Hello Magdala family, welcome to this very special interview. We have a, a guest today, a volunteer, that she's ending uh, her service here at Magdala. She's Anna Sophie. Anna Sophie, how are you? Hi, I'm very, very good. And you? Great, thank you. Tell us about you, how do you, how, what's your name, where you come from? Uh, my name is Anna Sophie. Um, I'm 26 years old. Uh, I'm coming from Mexico. I am. Uh, I finished my studies. I'm working now, and I'm very happy to be here. Thank you, Anna Sophie, and welcome. So, tell us that. How do you find out about the opportunity of coming here as a volunteer in Magdala? Um, so, one of my friends visited. Year, um, I think last year, and she told me about this volunteering. Um, since I was going to be here in Israel for an event, she told me like you should go before and go to Magdala and be a volunteer. So I started like researching about it, and I fell in love with with this. So I had to come. So that's how you I, found out. Yeah, I found out. And Sophie, we know that as a volunteers you can serve in many area, areas. What was your main area during this time? Um, so I was here for three weeks and um, I was in the, volu in the <laughs> visitor center, sorry, and I helped with the, like charging products and uh, cleaning and organizing everything. Um, so yeah, it was very fun. Yes, you should see her. <laughs> and and as uh, we know that as a volunteer, you have a lot of, of experiences, and you get the chance to visit uh, many places in the Holy Land. What would you tell to the people that is watching this video that was your main experience, or, or something that really helped you or changed you in some way? Um. So I've had a lot of experiences here, like here in Magdala and outside in holy places. Um, but one of the the most like impressive experience was in Mount Tabor. It was a very beautiful experience. Like as soon as I got there, like I would feel, well, I felt Jesus's presence, and it filled my heart with a lot of joy and tears and it was very beautiful and right now like just before this interview I had a mass here in Magdala and it was amazing it was a Hakuna mass so it was very special and uh, yeah that that was also one of my favorite moments well, with the with the group from from Spain yeah <laughs> and Anna Sophie uh, if you could uh, tell us in one phrase or in three words your experience like a, yeah to 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 share with everyone what what would be that phrase or three words that could describe everything that you lived mm, so i would say um so it's uh like i I've started to learn more about that phrase, which is like, go deeper. Um, so yeah, I think I, I have to apply that in my life, like to go deeper in faith, go deeper in love, in uh, encounter with people. So yeah, like, dukin altum. Dukin altum. Yes. That's where we are? Yes. In the dukin altum. <laughs> so Ana Sophie, thank you so much for your service. Thank you for this interview. We hope you the best and thank you Magdal family for your time. Thank you. Bye bye.